Motorcycle Live 2018. I'm here on a TT stand with uh, one of the most famous riders still competing in the TT course, Ian Hutchinson. Right, first of all, Ian, you know, you haven't flown down in your helicopter this weekend. No, I've not. I'm um, down here a few days. I don't fancy getting stuck in any fog or getting lost and end up upside down. So, in the old car, a couple of hours driving. It's been pretty quiet since the Alaman TT. You know, I haven't really seen you out and about at various functions or, or the racing. You haven't been competitive since then. No, uh, I mean, it was a real push for me to try and make the TT. And um, the frame was only off three weeks or something before it. So it was nice to get there, do 39 laps. But um, after it, I was pretty tired and needed some time off, really. So I gave it six weeks to make a decision on the Ulster and then realised I was still on crutches then. I wasn't strong enough. I wasn't going to be able to go and be competitive at the Ulster. So um, I've just had some time out and done some trips to MotoGP, World Superbikes, went to Assen for BSB on a road bike and just had a bit of time out, really. You know you still got your Honda shirt on, two-year deal, so you're staying put for 19. The same thing or any British Championship as well? No, I was um, trying to do something in the British Championship, but it's just not worked out at the moment. But um, with Honda Europe, I'm trying to get a plan to maybe do some stuff elsewhere where we can use the same tyres that we're using on the roads. And um, we've got quite a good testing plan coming up as well through the winter. I've already done a two-day test. Uh, two weeks ago in France, which is the first time I've ever tested in November. So, um, yeah, we're just going to aim everything at a TT for next year, really, and I'll be really busy riding from now till the northwest, and then on, on to the TT, and then um, we'll get a plan from there on for maybe doing something in British later on in the year or for the year after. A few days ago here at Mozart Live, we had your teammate for 18, obviously Lee Johnson here on the, on the stand, and... Uh, He's not with Honda again for 19. Can you tell us who it's going to be, who your teammate is? Uh, I don't actually know at the moment, but um, i have probably be the last to know. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, Lee was a good good teammate this year, and um, you know we had some a bit of fun. He was probably really unfortunate that um, a lot of the testing that we went to, the weather was rubbish. It rained at Castle Coombe and um, rained at Monte Blanco. I was quite happy about it because I wasn't missing anything. But yeah, he's... Um, gone off to do other things for next year so we'll see who's on the bike with me for next year you know it'll soon come around you'll soon be testing after the winter realistically and getting ready for the new year and I'm, I suppose it's going to be the northwest of the first competitive outing for you yeah the northwest will be the first racing that we do um, bikes are pretty much the same as before the team have been working away just on little bits and bobs to make me more comfortable on the super bike and um like I say, we're going to get a lot of track time through winter uh, and just aim everything ready for the TT, really. Spot on. Now, you're here all day today, but you're going to be back here for TT day on Sunday. Yeah, back on Sunday. And um, I don't know, there'll be more riders, I presume, that are TT riders for it to be a TT day. But um, yeah, back here and it'll probably be a lot busier on a weekend as well. Spot on. Thanks, Ian. Thank you.